Hi guys, this is a difficult video for me. I've been trying to make it, but it's just too sad. This is the first time I've actually been able to do this without crying. Uh, my dog Isabella, she died about almost two weeks ago already. And I'm having a really tough time with that because she was so much to me. Like I've had her since she was six weeks old. We shared the same birthday and she had such a unique personality. She was very temperamental and she was jealous. She had to have all the attention. All the toys were hers, all the food was hers, but she was an amazing dog. And I don't know what I'm gonna do without her. She was just such a big part of our lives. And um, I'm gonna include um, pics of her. This is a memorial for her. And so I hope you guys enjoy it. Excuse my appearance, I just got out of the shower. Um, having an animal from six weeks old to like six and a half years old, 10 years, whatever, like it's really hard when you lose them. And it's hard for you to let go because you have so many memories of them and you wonder what you could have done or you know what went wrong or whatever the case may be. I was lucky enough that I did get to say goodbye to her. I was with her her last moments. I took her outside one last time and when I, she couldn't walk to come back in the house and I carried her like a baby and she just collapsed and laid her head on my shoulder. And then I brought her in here and I laid her on my bed and she laid with me and she put her head on my, on my back while I was crying as if she was telling me it's gonna be okay. And eventually she got to the point to where she didn't want to be with me anymore. She wanted to be on her own. So she fumbled around and she fumbled around until she finally collapsed. And she just, she died on my bathroom floor. And I found her and I couldn't believe it. I just couldn't stop crying. Like, I, I don't remember when I cried that hard last. It's not something that you can just get over. And people seem to think, oh, it's just an animal. It's just a dog. It's just a cat, whatever the case is. But it's not. Like, when you have that bond with an animal, you can't just get over it. It doesn't go away. It's like losing a family member. So if any of you guys are going through this or they we went through it, I understand what you're going through. It's really hard. So I have my memories of her, and nothing can ever take that away. When she was a puppy, I don't know how many times, like, she'd fall asleep and she'd be curled up and she would just, she'd pee. So it was like having a baby pee on you. And I didn't get mad at her, she was a baby. And we have been through so much stuff, like she was such a stubborn dog. She had to have all the attention. If my chihuahua was sitting on my lap, she had to sit on top of my chihuahua because she had to have the attention. It was all about her. And when you'd come home, she'd like scratch at your feet because she'd be so excited, she'd dance across the floor. She'd be so excited because mommy and daddy are home. And like she had so many silly moments about her that I will never forget. And so this is in memory of her. So um, I'm including some pictures and a couple of videos that I have of her. And some of you may care, some of you may not care. But this is just a memorial for her. And to let you guys know that if you were to go through this, I know where you're coming from. So I hope you enjoy. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell because I'm going to try to do new videos every week. Thank you. What? What do you want? What is it? What do you want? Really? Yeah? Why don't you tell me about it? You tell me about it. You tell me. Come here. Tell your Uncle Gabe. What's the, what's the matter? What's the matter? 
What is it? Uh, what's the matter, baby? Tell your Uncle Gabe. <laughs> what's the matter? <laughs> itchy. Are you itchy? Are you itchy? What's the matter? You mad at your tail? What? What do you want? What do you want? What? What do you want? What do you want? What? Alright, boundaries, dude. Dude, personal space, boundaries, boundaries. What? Get your ass out of my face.